Well guys, as promised, we're doing our end of the year wrap up here. The driveway line over here runs right down the middle. Everything on this side's mine, everything on that side's Austin's. Big bowl in the center is actually a pickup that I never got on camera. We found that and uh, had to get DWR's permission to take it out of there. But uh, they did fortunately let us have it. So we're gonna do a quick little, we're gonna talk about our antlers quick. So uh, on my side here, I've got 61. Um, you know, here's most of our little two points and stuff, but along the back, we've got, I've got my sets for the year. There's a 4x4 four four set that I picked up with binoculars. There's a broken four point set. And there's Pitchfork, and the white off to the left of Pitchfork is Pitchfork from a previous year that I also found this year. There's a set that I picked up later on in the season. And there's a small three. We've got a few bull elk antlers. We didn't get either of those on camera either, but I did get the one in the center. There's the matching set that I unfortunately did not get on camera. Jeez, I did not get any of my bull elk antlers on camera, did I? I oh, know. Yeah. Got this. I got the got the skull. Um, that the skull mount right there is actually a mountain mic reproduction mount of the big four x four set that Austin helped me find the other side too. So I'm gonna have Austin hold that for a second, just so y'all can see what it looks like in relation to an actual human. <laughs> That buck has scored at 171 inches and yeah, as you can see it looks freaking awesome on that mountain mic reproduction. I recommend if you all want to, if you have a set that you'd like to mount up to purchase a mountain mic reproduction. Um, this is a mule deer set obviously but you know they work, I think the skulls actually look better with the whitetail. So if y'all are whitetail hunters that's a good way to go. Works for sheds and for bucks that you shoot. And that's a little mount project that I did on a dead head that I found. And I'm gonna be dyeing the antlers on this big bull and mounting that one in my garage. That's a seven by seven bull with a little bit of palmation inside here takes two hands for me to get all the way around that fat part in that, that bull. And I got him squared up at 336. I'll let AJ take the camera and talk about his. Okay. I didn't get a lot of mine on camera because I wasn't always with Andrew. I picked up that moose paddle along with a bunch of those elk sheds. Uh, I think three of them were in the same day. This, these two matching sets here, they're whites, but I think they're restorable. This is the one that I found when I was with Andrew. This six point here, this little guy. I actually got the other five point. Yeah, we got that one on camera. Um, this one I found when I was riding my dirt bike. It was laying in the river. Just I saw the tines sticking up as I was going by out of the water. So that was pretty cool. Uh, there's a couple chalk ones. They're okay, you know, they're chalk, but still a shed. Um, I didn't get a lot of matching sets this year, so I'm hoping I'll find a lot of whites next year that are matches. There's one match. Um, here's that set. It's uh, the big non-tip. A lot of you didn't think it was a match, but even today when we look at it, we are still saying it is. And there's a matching two I picked up. I think that's, that's pretty cool, much it for my match. Such matches. a cool matching set. I know it. This guy I almost thought 
I found the match to here. This guy was cool. Yeah, big old five. He's just got so much mass. Sorry, dude. Oh, this is his other. This is the other one that. This is the other one we thought was the match, but it's not. It's definitely a different. Different box. masses. Here, hold those together. You can see. Different masses and different shape of the. Uh, and he's a pretty tip, antler. pretty much a typical, except for a few kickers. He's just kind of. And his eye guard looking. is so much bigger on this one. like five inches yeah big yeah I got 65 total this year uh, Andrew got 60, 62, 61. 61 so we're gonna try and beat that next year yep this little guy was a cool find one of my first finds of the year he's just teeny tiny I was complete luck to find him he fit in my pocket so Pretty cool. All right, guys. That was just 126 antlers right there between the two of us for the year. Our, some more areas to go to next year, so we're yeah, gonna beat it. We're uh, definitely gonna try and beat it next year. And we've got one more video coming out for the year. I'm going to just do a quick like two to three second clip of every single antler that we've got on a pickup. And it's gonna be the full season, just the pickups. Thanks for watching.